Taking a bath with my frog. Thank you for tuning in. Happy Holidays! Hanukkah, Merry Christmas, Feliz Navidad, Happy New Year! Last Christmas, I was a levitating Santa Claus, holding on to a candy cane instead of my regular cane. This Christmas, I'm just keeping it real in my grandmother's house, um, enjoying the festivities and getting presents. And I have some interesting videos to show you. First off, I got attacked by the cutest ducks ever. I'll show you that clip in a little bit. And then I bought a frog at the Chinese grocery store that was destined to be uh, butchered for frog legs. And I set it free into the wild for good karma. But before I did that, I took a bath with it. That's a little weird. But first, I want to show you the most amazing creature of them all. I brought my girlfriend out here. Melissa, come, come here. Come here. I want you to meet my fans. Hi, sweetie. Hi. So she got me the coolest Christmas present ever. A drone. Ah, ah, shit. Ah. Ow. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, whoa. I think I got it. Whoa. Don't fly that in here. Ah. <laughs> I just wanted to show you my dad, my father's sense of humor. This is what he got me for Christmas. It's uh, a monkey. A drunken monkey drinking beer. And there's a little uh, penis there. Okay, Dad. And then he got this one for Melissa. <laughs> it's a little bit more classy. Uh, monkey with the baby. And he also got this for Melissa. He shows, first he shows me, he's like, hey, Dan, I got this for you. And then he shows me this. And this one's Melissa's. This is you, and this is Melissa. I mean, this is my father for you. <laughs> Little angel assuming the position and drunken monkey getting ready. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, he got me this thing. I don't know. No, no, no. Don't show that one. <laughs> I think it's racist. Um, <laughs> Alyssa, did you tell your mom that you were visiting with some crazy people? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I didn't. <laughs> I, oh, <laughs> I, well, let me show you. Let me show you this video. I took her to the desert museum in Tucson. And I got attacked by the cutest ducks ever. Ooh, they were so cute. They got had my... pink beaks. Bite me. Oh. Here they come. Ah. Oh no, they're so scary. Ah. <laughs> ah, they're so scary. No! Ah. <laughs> Hello. <Hi>. Ow. <laughs> Can I pet you? No! Hi! Let me you. So I, I bought this frog to do a little photo shoot with it and, and then release it into the wild. And I took a bath with the frog. The frog did not know how to be a frog because it was contained in the tightest little container. Jammed in there with a bunch of other frogs. It couldn't barely move. So when I took it into the wild, it did not know how to be a frog it would try to jump and it would land on its head. I put it by the pond and it would not hop into the pond. It made me wonder, you know, this frog is not gonna survive. It's probably just gonna become food for other animals. You know, maybe this frog's destiny, maybe it's dharma was just to be eaten by humans as frog legs. Taking a bath with my frog. I'm taking a bath with my frog. I'm taking a bath. Yeah. How do you go? I'm taking a bath. I don't go up and down. He's not moving. He was swimming before. I don't know. It was it was a weird, surreal moment. Hey, you guys. Thank you for tuning in. If you want to see the video that I had up that was going viral, I levitated on the train in New York City, hands-free. This is a full levitation, not just a yoga balance. So, hey, I appreciate all of you guys. 
and I hope you guys strive in the new year to be as amazing and awesome as you possibly